MacBook Pro is a marked improvement, but clinging on to previously divisive design decisions only continue to hurt it in straight comparisons. While this update certainly don't ST disappoint, apply due diligence before clicking the buy button. In other words, the 13-inch 2017 MacBook Pro with Touch Bar is different than what it was 5, or even 2, years ago. That don't ST mean it s better or worse than it was then, just that it s different. So, bear that in mind as you scan through our review, for using the pros and cons we've gone into explicit detail and divulged. Although you can snatch one for yourself at $1,299. £1,249, £1,899, that MacBook Pro configuration lacks a key element, the OLED touch bar that replaces the function keys on higher tier models. If the touch bar, along with Touch ID verification, is on your must-have features list, you can expect to shell out no less than $1,799, £1,749, £2,699. In terms of form factor, Apple maintains its achievement of cramming a 13-inch screen into an 11-inch frame a la the Dell XPS 13 but this laptop's bezels are still a bit larger. Speaking of screens, Apple S Retina display is as sharp and color-rich as ever, even more so with its new, professional-grade P3 color gamut. While still relegated to supporting core Mako's functions and a few, major third-party apps, like Adobe Suite, the touch bar is incredibly fast at adapting to the task at hand. The strongest example of this is simply the touch bar as built-in spell checker, which is constantly suggesting words no matter how fast of a typist you are. Regardless, expect a similar level of performance between the three devices, given that they all make use of the latest Intel processors and super speedy SSDs. Not to mention that this MacBook Pro houses RAM clock at 2133 MHz to its rival's 1866 MHz, helping shore up some differences. Also, don't worry about that touch bar and touch ID module hogging any system resources, as both are powered by an ARM BAST T1 co processor the very same found in Apple's own Series 2 Apple Watch. This keeps 100% of the Intel chip's power devoted to core computing, 